So it's the 23rd of June and we're out in this cornfield. Um, the importance of planter fertilizer, we can't always stress it enough um, in getting early development. So we had a really good year this year, good spring, warm spring, and yet if you still don't put enough phosphate fertilizer on the planter, it's still going to show. So this this guy's planter, uh, the shear belt, shear belt broke on the planter, so we had 11.55 coming down here at about 250 pounds an acre. And then on this row here where the bolt broke, obviously there was no, um, no fertilizer coming down at all. So with the warm, warm weather conditions we had, you wouldn't think you'd get that much of a reaction on the plants. But when I dug them up with the shovel, this is the reaction that we got. So this is with no phosphate fertilizer. This is with 1152. And you can see the big difference on the root mass between the two of them. So basically phosphate fertilizer, what it does, is that it stimulates the roots and because the roots are bigger it can now soak up way more nutrients through the um, through the root system so again really really important to get the correct amount of phosphorus on in the planter now some people with liquid fertilizer are using um, um, 10340 that's great 26 gallons an acre is about the same as 1152 at about 200 pounds an acre. So that works great as well. So the important thing with phosphorus again is that you'll see it at this stage, but the plants never really catch up. So these two rows that where the phosphate wasn't on, you'll notice they'll tassel out a lot later as well. And come maturity time when the cobs are ready to go, these other rows will be right probably about a week to 10 days ahead of these rows. Okay, so phosphate not only stimulates the root to get a bigger and more healthier plant, but you'll also get to grow faster as well too. And you'll take a same hybrid like these ones next door, they'll basically mature about seven days faster when you get the correct amount of phosphate on the planter. Also when you get extreme weather conditions or chemicals being applied on, like we talked earlier about accent and other ones as well too, if you don't have the correct uh, planter fertilizer on, uh, you come over here now and you spray the accent on, you're going to get a much more severe reaction from some of the chemicals as well because the plants aren't quite as healthy as enough, healthy enough to digest and met metabolize that chemical out correctly. So, so again, can't say enough, try and get the correct amount of phosphate on every year that you plant and you'll avoid issues like this. It's always nice sometimes when, when um, the shear bolt does break on a planter because we get to see exactly what happens in some of these fields. So. So again, um, phosphate, really important in the corn planter. Keep an eye on your field, see how they're doing.